what is up guys welcome back to another episode of jack smith fishing as you can see i'm still in my pajamas because i just woke up and it's 10 30. yeah um today i don't even know what i'm gonna do i think we're gonna go sledding <laughs> really and truly but i don't know I have a little unboxing for y'all today. Um, I think I spent like 120 bucks, 140 dollars. I don't know. Um, here's a receipt. I have two of them. Um, I don't even care really. But all right, look, here's your receipt. So I spent 100. Hold on, I have two receipts. All right, let's see here. So I spent 100. I'm just gonna round that to. I spent hundred and twenty one dollars today or yesterday. Cause who would go to the store at ten thirty and buy fishing stuff? Oh no, but not me. All right, so I'll start off with like the main thing. So. I needed a new drop shot reel, so I splurged. So I got the Lose Mach 2 spinning reel. It's a dope looking reel. Um, it was like $79.99. The combo was $139, but I can't ship the rod home. So yeah. I already took it out of the plastic. It's real nice looking around. It's really smooth. Yeah, I really like it a lot. I don't know when the last time I used a spinning roll out, so. Oh, what's this? Did this junk come with, really come with directions? This is a luge, by the way. I probably already said that, and you probably see it on the box. Alright, so, that's that. Cool. I'm not going to throw that because I don't want to break it. So next I have a couple lures. Um, I got some Stankos. I got this is all that Farmer Fleet had and they're on sale so I bought them. So first I got well, green pumpkin with red flake. I don't know if my camera's gonna autofocus or not. If not, whatever. Next I got black and blue. I mean, you can't go wrong with black and blue. Black and blue is probably one of the best colors. And green pumpkin. For soft plastics. It's just black. It's got a couple. It's got blue flake in it. Next, I have. Wait. Number one ninety four with one ninety two tip. I don't know. It's basically just like. Yeah. All right. Next, they got. I have a Terminator Poppin' Frog. It's a pretty nice looking lure. It's got long, it's 
It's got a lot of spaghetti legs on it. I'm gonna have to trim those up. But yeah, so far so good. I don't know where to throw this. I don't. Last time I threw something, I got hooks stuck in my hand. So yeah, it's gonna be a pain in the ass, pain in the butt. You know what, that's gonna have to work. I don't do a whole lot of frog fishing, but I'm hopefully gonna start getting into it more. My buddy Mason's gonna help me out. I'm not really good with it. Oh yeah, that's exactly what it looked like when it came in the package. Let's go. But y'all can't look. But y'all can't make your papa frogs look that good. Oh, I don't know if I mentioned that was a papa frog. Next, I have, I think this might be an essential in your tackle box. The Z-Man Original Chatterbait in black and It's a pretty nice looking bait. Next, I have a Strike King KVD Sexy Dog, aka Spook. I have this Sexy Shadow color. I think she has probably one of the best hard bait colors. She's got a nice little rattle. I just like Strike King overall, in general. Their spinner baits are really good. I have one of them. Ugh, I feel like I'm still tired, y'all. I'm gonna need to retake that. Alright, next. That hurt. That hurt my head. Next, I got three crankbaits. They were on sale, so I bought them. Rapala. Clack and Crank. And Chartreuse Shad Color. Here, I'll open this up. Do y'all know what these things are? Let me know in the comments, please, because I have no idea. It's got one rattle in there. Pretty decent. Got the nice orange belly. Chartreuse body and the black top. Oh, where's the box for it? Alright, next I have her Apollo Lipless Crankbait. Another clock and wrap. And this is red crawdad color. It really does look a color. It's got the. God, I can't remember what that's called. Well, let's just say it's got the big old treble hook. Oh. It's a regular size treble hook with the elongated front barb. Let's say that. No. I don't know. Ow, 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 ow. Very sharp hooks. Very sticky hooks. As a Lunkers TV would say. Oh, 
son of a flavor biscuit here. I got a turbo hook stuck in my foot. Yep. Next, I have another same exact bait as the last one. This is in Chrome Sexy Shad. Yep. <sighs> yep. I needed some more crankbaits, so I got them. That's it for today, I think. No. That's it for today, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Come back later for more. Please subscribe and drop a like. And I'll do the same. And comment on... I know, guys, I don't have a GoPro. I'm about to get one. Hopefully. And I just... I know it's not fun to see me do unboxings and stuff. But... If there's anything else that I can do without a GoPro, please comment below. And I will definitely try. Um, I just, I don't know. Because I need a GoPro and a chesty. So, because I know a lot of like young and aspiring YouTubers don't have GoPros just off the bat. Because their parents are like, you don't need a GoPro. Exactly, I have one with me. But... We do need GoPros. We do. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. And as I said, subscribe and drop a like. When I get when I get a hundred subscribers, I will do a giveaway. All right. So remember that hundred subscribers giveaway giveaway.